What's up guys? Uh, hopefully in this video I hope to solve a major uh, want or, or request in the iPhone for iPhone and iPod Touch uh, and that request is copy and paste. Uh, and Apple could have easily integrated this, is definitely capable of doing it. But what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to show you a it's not a full featured copy and paste like you can't paste into the, the notes app or text or anything like that. But what you can do is copy and paste in Safari or from Safari to the mail app. What we're going to do is open up Safari and we're going to go to this website. It's called PasteBud. I will display that on the screen now. I've already got it entered in my browser so I'll just tap it. But I'll display that on the screen now. PasteBud.com. Let it load up. All right, now I'm going to tap into this, and basically it gives you then like how to install this. It's not really technically installing it; all it is is adding bookmarks. So what we're going to do first: tap copy, and then you're going to hit the plus button, and then add the bookmark, and then save. That simple. Now do the same thing with paste: tap it, add bookmark, and save. There you go. Now what we're going to need to do is edit those bookmarks. Tap into the bookmarks, hit edit, and as you can see, I've already actually entered in here once. Uh, what we're going to do is backspace everything before JavaScript. So this is what it's going to look like. Uh, it's going to look just like that. And once you're done ev backspacing everything before JavaScript, go back. And then you're going to do the same thing with paste. For some reason, it's not wanting to tap where I'm wanting to. Uh, same thing with paste. And then go back. Once you're done with that, hit done. All right, and then hit done. All right, now you're going to need to tap this little thing right here. Your secret pass pastebud address. Type in the subject, whatever you want. I'm just going to type in copy and then send. And let's wait till we hear the sound. All right, there we go. Now we know it's sent, and you can send them your feedback. All right, so now let's go ahead and get into the copy and paste part. So let's go to um, let's go to Yahoo. That's a good site. Okay, there we go. Now what you're going to do once the page is loaded up where you're wanting to copy something from, uh, just hit the bookmarks tab and then hit copy. And what it's going to do is it's going to load all the text from the pages you want to copy from in a pastebud kind of browser. All right, so what we're going to do, you'll see all the text. Let's see uh, whatever text we're wanting to copy. Let's find a paragraph, and you'll just see the pastebud thing will follow. All right, uh, let's pay, let's copy this. All you're going to do, tap and drag. That simple. As you can see, it highlights that. We're just going to hit copy. We'll say copying, and there we go. Now. If we're wanting to um, paste this into your Safari browser on another page, I'll show you that in just a second. But right now, I'm going to show you how to paste this into an email. Well, all you're going to do, hit the write new mail, and then you're going to select whoever you're going to send it to. I'm not going to open that up. But basically, whatever you copied, uh, for some reason it didn't work there. Let's see. I'll copy something else. Let's copy that. Okay, now hit right. Alright, there we go. I just had a little problem. And then as you can see, it pasted it in there, and then you can send it to somebody. Alright, so that's how you do it through the mail app. You can paste stuff into the mail app. Alright, now let's say we wanted to paste this into a another internet browser. As we already have it copied. Now what we're going to do, it's gonna you're going to go to another page, whatever page you're wanting to post it on. Okay. Let's say we're going to paste it in Google to do a Google search. My battery's about to die. Okay. Now, all you're going to do, hit the paste and bookmarks, and then it will load up. And as you see, it automatically detects where you want to paste it. So all we're going to do, tap right there, and as you can see, it automatically pasted in there. Uh, you're going to get this pop-up asking you if you want to upgrade. Uh, I don't know what features really you get out of that. I'm happy with what I got right here. So you can donate if you want, or you can send them five if you want to. Uh, to help them out. They have an awesome product, so it's good to show your support. Alright, so we're just going to hit cancel and then hit go. And as you can see, it pasted it in there. And we are doing a Google search for it. So that's basically it, guys. Thanks from the people from pastebud.com for this wonderful, wonderful thing for the iPhone and iPod Touch. Uh, I know I will definitely be using it because I would like to do this a lot. Uh, I've actually have another video about copy and paste, but it is nowhere near as good as this is. Alright, so that's basically it, guys. If you have any problems, leave me some comments. 
Uh, hopefully you can figure this out. It's pretty easy. But thanks for watching. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. Because when you do that, it gets me higher in the rankings and most viewed and stuff like that. And that lets more people see the videos. So just by leaving a quick rating or a comment could help somebody else learn about this. Uh, so thanks for watching. Make sure you visit tiesiphonehelp.com. Uh, join the forums. I'll have all the links and stuff in the video description. Thanks for watching.